What's up, everybody? It's your girl, the Press Composition, and welcome back to another episode of Living with the Englands. And unfortunately, it's a it's going to be a sad one. Um, Dolce and Lane just passed away after I made the first episode. Like, I think Lane was just dancing and talking to, you know, his granddaughter and his grandson. And then... What, where did he pass? He passed down, He passed away downstairs in the basement. And I tried to get Dolce to cook. And she passed away literally in the kitchen. And the only person who witnessed one of the deaths was Graham. And now he's very, very sad. Um, like, he was right there. Like, literally right here when um, Lane passed away. And Vivian, she is literally upstairs. She probably, she don't know nothing about it. She's just upstairs, you know, on her keyboard and things like that. And she don't know that they, that her that, that her grandparents are gone. So it, it's, it's, it's going to be really tough for them. But um, Graham is, is a young adult now. And he's going to have to probably get a job. And, um try to make ends meet for him and his cousin because right now things ha are, 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 um, are not okay for the family right now uh, but let's go ahead and get started into this episode we're gonna press play and Vivian she is just up here playing her games and meanwhile Gran I think the did the Grim Reaper just leave yeah the Grim Reaper just left and um, he's gonna go out there, and uh, as you saw previously a few minutes ago, I did a you know a special little sum sum for the um for uh Dolce and Lane. Well, Graham did something special. He put out flowers for them, and their uh, tombstones are out back in the backyard. So, <laughs> look at that. It, it is it's really sad sight right now. He is just very upset. Like, both of his grandparents are gone, bro. Like, both of them are gone. He didn't even know that, um... He didn't know that, uh, the adult tree, his grandmother died, but now he knows. But he's he work he like he's mourning over his grandfather the most because he saw him die like right in front of him. And, and look at her, she's just up there, you know, yeah, they did or whatever, but I'm still doing these jokes. Uh, but Dolce, she's supposed to cook for them a little some a little bit of breakfast, but unfortunately, um she didn't get a chance to because she just passed away suddenly. It was like very, very, very hard to just you know, like go away with that. I'm sorry, it's just very hard to see away with that because she's supposed to cook. And unfortunately, she didn't get a chance to because she passed away in the damn kitchen. What the heck? Why are you going to the bath? You're not going to the bathroom. You're going downstairs to prepare a meal that you could did upstairs. And whatever. He's gonna go guess what he's gonna do? Chat with somebody. Who are you gonna chat? Well, we need to get some friends around here. And he's gonna talk about, you know, his grandmother and grandfather's past and she's just gonna go down here and just cook. She is on that count of cooking. This is for for drinking and you down here. Okay. And we, we just gonna follow her because her crazy self. I thought she was gonna cook in the bathroom. But she was gonna cook just downstairs in the basement. I think that's more comfortable for her. Hopefully she doesn't burn this dog on house down. When she starts cooking. All this dog on counter space right here, but you could not pick him. I just, I just guess that was not easy for you. But yeah, Graham is just going through it. 
and I don't even know if Vivian knows. Oh God, oh God, I gotta watch her. All right, let's see how you did. And he he going through it. Okay, so that's excellent. And you can actually um. Why is that still in your hand? Put it away. Oh, that's a fork. Listen to Graham, y'all. And now he learned about his grandmother. Oh, my goodness. Yep, he just learned about his grandmother. So I think in the next episode I'm going to I think I already did that but I'm going to engrave the epitaph the epitaph and you know you know like Grant puts something not nice on there he's just going through with y'all it is not easy it's not easy so we're, we're, he's going to continue to mourn his grandmother it's just it's not I think he loved the grandparents more than Vivian did. I don't know what they did to um, Vivian while she was living while she was living in this hospital. Yeah, she gonna have to get herself together. And do you have homework? Did you even do your homework? Let's 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 do this homework right now. So, I'm gonna end this episode right here. I'm just gonna let Graham go through his his sense of mourning because he is just really going through with y'all, and it is this is not gonna be easy for him, you know, because he he's gonna have to be the man of the house now. Like they just died suddenly, and he's gonna be the man of the house. But anyway, that's it for the episode. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe if you enjoyed the video. Um, share the video as well. Click the notification bell, that way we know if I have all my videos. And um, yeah, man. We're going to see how this continues, but until then, you already know. Peace. RP Dolce and Lane.